Today I'm gonna to show you how to use a spin move to embarrass your defender. Let's go into first explaining what is a spin move. A spin move is nothing more than when a defender is playing your inside hip tight with intense pressure and you no longer can continue to go in your direction without what I call bellying out going sideways. All you simply do is you take the momentum away from your defender by going opposite of them. It's also called a reverse step. Objectively speaking, it's a reverse step. All I simply did was reverse my action. He's taking me to the right, I reversed it to the left, going away from him, taking his momentum away or her momentum away as the defender. Also, objectively speaking, the footwork of a spin move, also called drop step, it's always set up with the inside foot. Okay, so my left foot closest to the basket, my left foot, as I'm driving, he's on me. It's always set up by a plant of the left foot or the inside foot, I should say. Let me break that up so you understand. Left, right, doesn't matter. It's my inside foot closest to my defender that allows me to make that move, okay? So what I wanna do, again, like I said in the beginning, I wanna show you how to use the spin move to not only embarrass your defender, but to also get you quick opportunities to score a lot of points. Also, the spin move in the paint, it's called the drop step. I know we say different things. We say different things on the perimeter versus what we say in, in, in the low post uh, paint area. I like to just kind of keep it simple. It's a direct back step. So in the paint area, if a defender's on me, and again, he's playing my inside hip and shoulder because you don't want me to go to the middle, all I'm gonna do is simply brace the contact inside foot close to my defender and drop step away. That's a direct back step. I'm stepping towards my target, which is the backboard. So when I complete my step, I have a point blank layup. So a spin move drop step is all the same, but in the paint, we call it a drop step. We got that? Okay, now let me show you the fundamental footwork you must master in order to really master the spin move drop step. I said it earlier, it's a direct back step. And what I mean by direct back step, showing you from the side, is simply speaking, my left foot is my live foot. It's going directly back to my target. Right foot in this position is my pivot foot. This foot right here is dropping back. So now imagine me doing this at the basket. So you saw this before, he was on me. In this case, it could be my right foot. So what I'm gonna do is drop my right foot back towards my target. And on purpose, I'm stopping. This is a direct back step. I'm stepping towards my target. Your target might be, say, the rim. Target could be the backboard. Target might be a location on the perimeter, right? I may be making a play. Coming this way, I have to go say somewhere over here for a dribble handoff. So now, as I break down the footwork, we're gonna work on a direct back step. What we're gonna simply do, Jake, is showing sideways how to master the footwork is I'm gonna do a little spin out, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna have my right foot go back as my step, left foot's my pivot foot, as I twist turn, I'm gonna dribble so I can lift up that pivot foot, make sense? So we're not called for travel. So we're just working on the footwork. Right, drop step, get out, yours. Yep, nice, good. And we're gonna mix it up, Jake. Right, just kinda mix it up. Right, working on that direct back step one more time. Jump stop, get out. Okay, now, coming down to the baseline, same concept. Going to the basket now, spin out, elbow Jake, jump stop, spin it, go win it at the rim. Yours, love it, right? Again, working on that same footwork, getting right to the action. Good, change sides, Jake. Okay, outside foot starts to action, Jake. Outside foot starts to action, you go, I go. Euro step, finish that, I gotta make that. Ah. Ah. Nice, and there you have it. That's right there in a simple way of how you work on the footwork, your direct back step being a spin move. All right, last one on the spin moves. Now, Jake, we're gonna cross. This is speed. Now we're going to a game spot, shooting the game shot. So same concept. Now we're gonna attack the middle, Jake. Attack the middle and go, yours. Ready, go. Good, we might have a little traffic, right? I'm gonna have to use a Euro step. As you're going, I'm going, okay? I might have to avoid you. So working on different ways to finish. Last one, we attack the middle. Bang, and done, good job. We're trying to reach 4,000 subscribers by the end of the month, and we need your help. 
We roll out five high quality videos every week to help you become a premium basketball player. So help us reach our goal and click that subscribe button. Okay, now I'm gonna show you two fun spin drill, drop step drills, guaranteed to have you have game success. All they're simply going to be is learning how to turn the corner. First drill, Jake, is called beat him to the left. You get right next to me, over here, no ball. And your job as a defensive player is to, as I try to turn this corner, really guard my right hip shoulder and push me out. Force me to spin, and when I spin, you gotta play through it. So now when the defender's on your side, especially finishing, you wanna finish off two feet. All right, we go, take it away. Oh, I spin, I gotta keep spinning, and I might spin again for my shot opportunity, right? It goes, here we go, take off whenever you're ready. Nice, oh, good beat, good job. Now, what you do on the right side going left, we go to the left side going right. So take off, spin move, oh, fake, in and out. Go finish that, I gotta make that. Yep, ah, ooh, spin it. Ah. Good. Beat him to the right, beat him to the left. Push up. Oh, 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 he broke the rules, y'all. He broke the rules, which I love. You've got to learn to break the play. He probably sensed I was ready and sitting on that spin move and stayed here. He gave me a half spin. He kept his attack to win to the basket. I love that. But those are two great drills you can do. Beat him to the right, beat him to the left. Reenact and turn the corner to really learn how to spin to not only embarrass your defender again, but to score when you take momentum away from your defender. So to finish out, we did a perimeter attack, right? Beat him to the left, beat him to the right, turn the corner. Now let's talk about low block. All right, so here's the drill, Jake. We're gonna stand next to each other. You're gonna be on offense. I'm gonna spin the ball out to the first hash mark. I'm gonna play your right side, hip, shoulder. Give you good body contact. You could crab dribble if you want to to give me a good setup in to drop step back, right? Ready? Go. Here. Nice. Good setup. Perfect. Good. My turn, right? Yours. Yours. You come out. I get a feel. Catch chin check. Take them where I need them. And they're going to score the basketball. Let's change it. Ready? Go. Yep. Give them a good feel. He took me uphill. He dropped. Love that. Right? Yours, right? Here. Good. Get a feel. Catch it, first C, catch. Second, check the floor. Chin the ball, third, crab him, drop step, and score that basketball. Same way you're working on a perimeter, you can have the same competitive games against a good teammate on the block for drop steps. Let's keep the momentum going with that bonus I mentioned earlier. We've covered a lot in this video, and I really want to make sure I'm helping you out. So I'd like to offer you a guide that covers all the muscle and basketball principles and in what switch to apply them. This is a powerful guide of best practice tips and skills empowering you to take charge of your game. Just click the link in the description below. You can download the guide I put together as my gift to you. And if you're really interested in becoming an all-around elite player, check out our Training Vault bundle that can be found at the same link. It contains over 130 videos and three courses that cover 10 areas of basketball. It has everything you need to take control of your game. Enjoy your gift and keep attacking.